Hi friends, the 27th lesson I learned this year is do not worry about tomorrow, for tomorrow will worry about itself, as seen in Matthew chapter 6, verse 34. I understand that it is hard to not think about tomorrow when we see how our world is changing, and I mean changing daily. It does pose a bit of concern when we see our leaders make decisions that defy common sense and goes against what we know to be right and truthful. Being aware of what is going on from what we see on social media or the news, if you watch it, spells disaster, no matter how you look at it. If we can turn our attention to the Bible and see what God says, because after all, he is in control. All we see has to happen to allow God's will to play out. As long as we stay strong in God's word, cement our faith in him, we need not worry about the world. As each day is behind us, it sure does look like Jesus is coming soon. Remember when Jesus said to his disciples, do not let your hearts be troubled. Believe in God, believe also in me. This is a message that can be found in all four gospels of the Bible. It's one of the most comforting passages for people who are feeling anxious or fearful. When this passage is read, it's often accompanied by an excerpt from our Savior's Sermon on the Mount, which reads, Therefore do not worry about tomorrow, for tomorrow will worry about itself. Each day has enough trouble of its own. It means that we don't need to fear what will happen in the future because we know from the book of Revelation that these are the times we are living. This is why it's so important to be close to God, to understand who he is. God's word is truth. We may not know how things will turn out tomorrow, but God does. Thank you for watching. Tune in tomorrow for lesson 28. God bless you and stay safe.